Hi, how are you? I hope you all good and enjoying your life with your family, friends and colleagues. Today video is about Nibosh IGC. Nibosh IGC is most asking question and uh, many my friends, colleague and uh, viewers asking me about Nibosh IGC. What is Nibosh IGC? How we do it? Why we do it? What is the need? And how the Nibosh IGC can be a pass? So these kind of question asking very often to me. So I decided to make this video in full detail about Nibosh IGC. This video may uh, a little bit long. So I, uh, if this video is going long, then I will divide it into uh, different uh, parts. So you can uh, watch this easy and not take much time. Uh, I try my best to summarize uh, in this one video. But if not possible, then I will divide it into two. So first we will look into what is the Nibosh IGC. Basically, first we have to look what is the Nibosh. So Nibosh is a National Examination Board in Occupational Safety and Health. It is a UK based examination board that offer globally recognized qualification in health, safety and environment management. Nibosh qualification are highly respected in industry where managing risk and ensuring workplace safety is crucial. The most popular uh, Nibosh qualification includes Nibosh General Certificate. Uh, this we normally call Nibosh GC. And what we are discussing most uh, in this video is Nibosh International General Certificates, Nibosh IGC. So Nibosh GC, Nibosh General Certificate, this is the most common qualification and is often required for those looking to begin or advance a career in health and safety. It covers essential health and safety principle, risk management and workplace hazard. Nibosh GCC is basically, uh, Nibosh General Certificate is basically UK based uh, people, those are living in the UK. Nibosh International General Certificate, which we discussed today, Nibosh IGC, similar to the general uh, certificate, but with a focus on international standard and practices. It is suitable for professional working outside of the UK. Then the Nibosh, Nibosh Diploma, a more advanced qualification. The Nibosh Diploma is designed for those aiming for a senior position in health and safety. It cover in-depth knowledge of health and safety, law, risk management and occupational health. Uh, Nibosh Environmental Certificate focus on environmental management and it is designed for those uh, responsible for managing environmental issues while within the workplace. Nibosh Construction Certificate uh, tailored for the construction industry it addressed the specific health and safety challenges in construction environment. So Nibosh qualification are recognized by professional bodies like the Institute of Occupational Safety and Health, IOSH and International Institute of Risk Safety Management, IIRSM, making them valuable for career development in health and safety. What is Nibosh IDC, which is main thing which we are going to cover in this uh, video. The Nibosh International General Certificate is widely recognized qualification in occupational health and safety. It is designed for individual working outside of the UK who need board understanding, uh, sorry, who need the broad understanding of health and safety principles and practices. The IGC is especially popular among those seeking to start or advance their career in health and safety in various uh, industries globally. Key feature uh, of Nibosh IGC, uh, international focus. The Nibosh uh, uh, IGC emphasizes international standard and the best practices. Particularly the International Labor Organization ILO codes of practices. It is relevant uh, 
to professional working in different countries and industries offering a globally perspective on health and safety management. A course structure. The, the main thing which we have to know what is the course, uh, what is the course uh, structure uh, basically. So the course is typically divided into three units. IGC, uh, IG1, Management of Health and Safety. IG2, uh, Risk Assessment. The IG1 is, uh, uh, IG1 unit focus on the principle of health and safety management, covering the topic uh, such as uh, risk management, health and safety law, and the, and the responsibility of employers and employees. The IG2 unit involve practical assessment where learner must conduct a risk assessment in their workplace, demonstrating the, their ability to identify and control hazard. Uh, assessment, the assessment for Nibosh IGC include written examination for the IG1 and a practical assessment for the IG2 unit. The practical assessments involve applying the knowledge gained from the course to a real world scenario showcasing the learners through comp uh, learner competency in the identifying hazard and recommended controls measure. So now in these days this is only the IG1 and IG2 uh, currently IG1 uh, and IG2 and uh, then there are interview uh, from the server, uh, from the course providers the, uh, then now uh, how, uh, we discuss who should take the Nibosh IGC uh, the Nibosh IGC is suitable for managers, supervisors, safety officers and other responsible for health and safety in their organization. It is also ideal for those looking to start their career in occupational health and safety as it provides a solid foundation in the field. This is not only limited to the uh, OHS occupational health and safety professional, uh, those uh, personals are are uh, those uh, designations like any managers, engineers, those are managing their people, those are responsible to manage the people, assets and environment in the company. The, this course is ideal for them. And nowadays, many organization uh, taking this into their in the training matrix. So as this is a level three basic course, so the um, most of organization currently uh, taking into their training mat matrices and disappear during the training need analysis TNA. So they are putting into their training matrix, uh, matrix for the managers, engineers, supervisor level. So they can understand what is the basic requirement for the uh, for making a uh, safe their workplaces and their people and environment. So the benefits uh, achieving the Nibosh IGC demonstrates a strong understanding of health and safety practices which can enhance a career uh, prospects. Uh, it is recognized by professional bodies such as Institution of Occupational Health and Safety IOSH, and the International Institute of Risk and Safety Management IARSM. The qualification helped organization to ensure compliance with international health and safety standard reducing the risk of workplace accidentally and legal issues. The Nibosh IGC is highly valued by employers around the world, making it a key qualification for those aiming to building successful career in health and safety. As I mentioned earlier, this is not limited to only OHS professionals, but this is also need of other uh, senior designations like manager, general managers, engineers. So they also know what is the requirements as per law, as per ethics, as per the risk assessments and these things to save their people, asset and environments.